Hello everyone, it's me Chebby from Inec Tutorials. Today in this video I will show you how to fix unable to install or run .exe or .msi files in any Windows computer. So run for more delay, let's begin. So firstly, let me show you I want .msi files, so let me show its properties. So you can see here Windows Installer Package .msi. So if you have a .exe also, the tricks will remain the same. So let us try to install it by default Windows Installer. So let me proceed to install this software. So finally, you can see there is a problem with the Windows Installer Package. A program required for this install to complete could not be done contact your support person. So if I click on OK, you can see the software is failed to install. So how you can fix this issue on your respective Windows computer? So for this, just select your installer or the .exe or .msi file, then just right click on it and just click on properties. Now here you will see one option, name is compatibility, just click on it. Now. You can see here below one option, compatibility mode, just turn this on, run this program in compatibility mode for previous versions of Windows. And you can see below more options since settings for all users, just click on it here too and just turn this on, run this program in compatibility mode 4 and now click on apply, click on ok and once again click on apply, click on ok. Now let us try to install this software again so wait for a few seconds until the complete installation is done so finally you can see this time we don't have any error applic so if you click on close so you can see our new software has been installed and now you can see the shortcut icon of this respective installer or the software so this is how you can fix unable to install or run .exe or .msf files in windows computer very easily so if you never known about the school tricks then definitely you should try it out and if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching